Ah, there we go. Port Ryerson Marina. Our boat's winter storage area. A little ice in the bay. There's a nice wood boat for you, Glenn. No, that's fiberglass. It looks like, like wood, but it's fiberglass. Oh, there your baby is. New spot. If you want to see this boat in the water, go back to my video of heading for winter storage part one, and you will see her in the water. It's a 22 foot Doral, Terra. And now we'll head up to where the Edna Michelle is stored. It's a damp, cold, kind of rainy a little bit. And there she is, the 1978 Carver, 28 foot, in her winter home. And she looks like she's wintered well. See, she shrunk the bridge for me. Now a lot of people have remarked about this uh, door that was put on this boat. It can be done on an inboard. It cannot be done on a stern drive because the stern drive uses the stern as support. Where on the inboards they don't. Uh, she looks like she's wintered well. And in three months' time, we'll be back and I'll be living on her for the summer. Now, 13K, 73, 215. This boat is originally from Gibson's Harbor in British Columbia. And she spent about 10 years of her life in there. And then she moved there to the fresh, fresh water. So this boat hasn't seen fresh water in at least 30 years. Or, excuse me, salt water in at least 30 years. 
I got to get her her new names for the side there. When they made them up for me, they didn't make them up big enough. And there we go. There we go. Port Rowan, January 18th, 2023. And this is my friend's dock here. And the Edna Michelle docks right here. And with luck in three and a half months, we'll be out here. <laughs>